Hi, you guys. I was just in Sprouts getting um, red lentils and things because I'm going to make a uh, D-Man's curry in a fucking hurry today for the first time. And uh, I ended up getting a couple other things, of course, because they had day on sale, five, uh, two for five dollars. And they had a couple other things on sale, so I grabbed some stuff while I was there, but not too much, just one bag full. But anyway, the guy that checked me out, was he's an older gentleman that works there. He's always super sweet to me. <laughs> and uh, right now he's like, oh, look at you eating so healthy. <laughs> Good for you. He goes, you're vegan, aren't you? <laughs> I was like, yeah, I am. He's like, I bet you feel so good about that. And I was like, yeah, I do actually. And he was like, good for you. <laughs> that's funny. So obviously he's not vegan, but he knows what it is. So that's good. <laughs> I thought that was so cute. And he was like, oh, good for you. <laughs> but he was being completely like sincere. He wasn't being sarcastic or anything. He was sweet. So yeah, anyway. That was fun. <laughs> now I'm heading home and I'm going to put my stuff away and I'll show you what I got, of course. It's not very much, but a few things I'll show you. And I have to work today, so I'm not really doing much else. I am still playing with my camera, learning how to use it. Yesterday I tried to make a video on my camera and um, my memory card ran out of memory in six minutes flat. <laughs> Actually, it was less than six minutes, but I have a couple pictures on there too. So it was like a couple pictures and like five and minutes and like 45 seconds of video and my memory card died and it said, nope, you can't record anymore. And I was like, what? <laughs> so I was just practicing anyway. So it wasn't, I wasn't really talking about anything important or whatever. So I'm not going to worry about not uploading that video or whatever. I'm just going to delete it. But, um. Um, I ordered a, a 128 gig memory card that is HD, I don't know, it's made for HD, so hopefully it says it can record up to 29 hours of HD video, so we'll see. Hopefully it works like it says, because the card I was using is 32 gigs, and if I can only record about 6 minutes on a 32 gig, then that means I could only record about 20 minutes on 128 gigs, so... Hopefully it really does record 29 hours of HD video. But anyway, that's pretty much all I've been doing is playing with my camera and nothing else. So yesterday I wasn't feeling well. Whatever I ate at work at lunch made me sick and I ate healthy. So I don't know. I don't really trust their food anymore. It seems to make me sick more often than not. So I'm going to try really hard to just bring my own food to work from now on. Um, so I'm going to make the curry and hopefully it's really good. I've heard good things. And I've never made a real curry before, so I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. I've never had a curry that actually has coconut milk in it and everything, so today will be the day, and we'll see. And I'm probably gonna eat it even if I don't like it because I'm making it in the Instant Pot and I'm gonna have a lot of leftovers. But here's hoping. And of course, I'll let you know how it turned out and if I like it or not. And that's it. I'm almost home. <laughs> so I'll catch you in a little while when I uh, show you my haul. Came home and my kitty cats are hanging out. <laughs> Here's my little Sprouts haul. They had deli sizes a dollar off. They were on sale for $1.99. So I just got one. And then two for five on the Daya, two for five on the black bean hummus. Their tofu is really cheap. It's only like $1.79 for the organic, which is really good. And then I got some Hemptation bread, some oatmeal. I got these non-chips to go with my curry. Smart Dogs are on sale. I think it was $3.79. Smart Balance and then these um, organic red lentils, bulk items. That was everything. I didn't get very much, like I said. Just a quick haul and I spent... 3806. I decided to make a grilled cheese with the daya and the tofurkey. I'm still gonna make my red lentil chili though so that I have something to take with me for dinner. All right, this is the curry mix. Now I'm just adding the five cups of water that it calls for.
And I'm gonna set it for 15 minutes on high. And we'll see how it turns out. I actually followed the directions, what do you know? Didn't add any extra ingredients or anything. <laughs> so my curry is done. You hear it venting. I'm trying to decide if I should make rice. I mean, I'm not hungry. I'm just going to take it for dinner, but it's supposed to go over rice, right? I bought these chips to eat with it. So I'm thinking I'll just scoop these into it. I'll have to see how watery it is. If it's not very watery, then I'm not going to make rice. It's very watery then I might make rice it's already quarter to 12 and I have to leave for work at 1 o'clock so I kind of want to take a nap but I don't know the guys downstairs are working on our neighbors downstairs moved out and the guys have been down there moving appliances and cleaning and fixing things so I can't really nap because they're really noisy and they keep like yesterday they woke me up from my nap so I feel really tired but I'm probably gonna have to stay awake I guess I'll just have to remember right now to take my iron because I keep forgetting. I took it yesterday, but I'm really bad at taking it every day. I take this uh, a place to heal. You guys have seen it before unless you're one of my new subscribers. And if you are, welcome to my channel. You guys are awesome. Thanks for subscribing. This is the uh, iron that I use, a place to heal, oxygen rich iron tonic. And that's the website, a place to heal dot oops sorry dot e crater dot com if you want to check it out let me go ahead and take that and actually i need to take my b12 too because i keep forgetting to take my b12 as well and then i'll show you my curry in a second looks pretty thick. Hmm. Are the lentils supposed to be super mushy? Because they definitely didn't hold their shape. <laughs> Maybe that's why it goes over rice. Like I said, I never have had a real curry before, so I don't know. But yeah, it's very mushy. So I think I am going to go ahead and make some rice to, to take with me to work. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and taste it on one of these non-chips. I'm making rice now, so I'll have rice to take with me to work. It's super hot. I keep forgetting I had a tooth pulled too, so like when I, I made that grilled cheese, I took a big old bite of it and then was like, ah, can't chew on that side yet. Gotta be careful. Mm. That's really good. Those chips are really good too. Let me try one plain. These are garlic flavored too, so it adds even more flavor to the ch That's really good. I just remembered though. I said that I followed the directions and I did except for I didn't add a teaspoon of cayenne like it said I only added like a dash of cayenne because I don't like too much spice so it's nice and mild for me it tastes really good I really like it it's a thumbs up considering I'm gonna put it over rice it might need a little bit of salt it might need a little bit of black pepper for me but other than that it's really good it gets a thumbs up I would say I don't know, I've never had curry before, so I like it. I would say probably like a an 8 out of 10 or maybe a 9 out of 10. It's pretty good. I mean, like I said, it's my first curry, so I don't really have anything to compare it to, but I like it. It's good. I'll definitely make it again. So, thumbs up, Derek. <laughs> Thanks for sharing your recipes. Um, you and Hannah are awesome.